Uh, could you talk about your life after the championship? Uh, how? Well, uh, for me, it was it was hard a little bit. Um, a little bit, I was a little bit disappointed uh, the way it ended. But uh, with me, everything happened for a reason, so I have to respect that. Um, but um, I'm, I'm relaxed now. I got treatment for my my hamstrings. Uh, it's gonna take one month to to get better. Uh, so right now I'm just trying to relax, uh, do a few sponsorship tours, and vacation as much as possible. How how did you manage yourself? You know, I think there there are times that you, you might you know feel depressed or sad. Or <coughs> I think uh, for me initially it was hard uh, because uh, I always tried to please other people. When I was younger, I always wanted to to make my family and my, my, my country proud. And any time I didn't win and people would say, oh, he's no good, or I would feel really bad about myself. But I learned quickly that the fact is I'm doing this for myself. That's the first thing. And I try to explain to a lot of athletes that you're doing this for yourself first. Everything comes after that. You have to always remember as an athlete that there will be bad times. You know what I mean? And you can't listen to all the negative things around you. You have to you have to listen to your team, the people that support you and say, listen, you're gonna do better, you're gonna be you're gonna get back and stuff like that. So it's hard, but you have to be strong and know. But the key thing is remember that you're doing this for yourself first. Everybody, the country, your family, your friends, everybody comes after you. You're doing this for yourself. Yeah. How big a deal for a sprinter to Run under 10 seconds? Uh, I think if, if the, the field is running, uh, if, if, you're, if you're winning, you're not running 10 seconds, then it's fine. Mm -hmm. But if you're not winning and running, not running under 10 seconds, then you have to work harder to get under 10 seconds. That's how I see it because at the end of the day, if you're competing, it's all about winning. So if you can win and you, you run 10 1, it's fine. You know what I mean? Yeah, so it's all about what it takes to win. Give a one advice, one technical advice to kids. What, what will you do? What will, what <laughs> technical will advice. Uh, what would I say? Uh, do a lot of core work. <laughs> That's one. I think a lot of most people uh, always, it's core is very important. Your back and your abs, abs are very important. That if you, if that's very strong, then most of the things you won't get injured uh you'll be more stable running so that helps a lot of the the work that you have to do uh technical wise so strong core is very important in your next phase well uh, as you know i've always wanted to play football uh something that i'm really thinking hard about so after my hamstring heals uh, i think i might try to get some uh trials with some different teams, uh, we'll see. Um, but right now, um, I'm working on like doing more charity work, uh, doing a lot of work with my sponsors, uh, trying to relax as much as possible. So that's what the focus is on right now.